Look inside this incubator. These eggs were laid 21 days ago, and this one is just about to hatch. If you listen, you can hear the chick pecking at the inside of its shell. Soon it will break through and take its first breath of fresh air. It's a dramatic moment, that first breath, one shared by so many creatures, including us. But hold on, think about this. When you were in the womb, you got oxygen from your mother through your umbilical cord. But for the last 21 days, this chick has been cut off from its mother, sealed inside an egg. So how does it get oxygen? An egg seems like a perfectly self-contained system. The yolk and the white contain all the nutrients you need to build a baby chick. As with a human baby, all this construction requires oxygen. And that's the one thing that isn't stored inside the egg. So where does it come from? Well, take a look at this. When you magnify an egg shell a thousand times, you can see the calcium carbonate crystals that make up the shell, and here and there, tiny holes, one thousandth of an inch across. And these tiny holes let outside air filter in. So oxygen can pass through the shell, but the chick growing inside doesn't have working lungs yet. How does it get that oxygen into its bloodstream? Well, a few days after an egg is laid, something amazing happens. When you hold a fertilized egg up in front of a bright light, you can see it, a delicate network of blood vessels that grows out of the embryo's abdomen and presses up against a membrane just inside the shell. Oxygen from the air comes in through the tiny holes in the shell and then diffuses into the embryo's blood, and the growing chick gets rid of carbon dioxide at the same time. That's because the whole time oxygen is coming in through the shell, moisture is slowly evaporating out. That creates an empty space that gradually fills with air. A day or so before the chick is ready to hatch, it starts to move. It punctures that air pocket and fills its lungs. It then has just enough oxygen to battle out of the egg and take its first breath of fresh air.